All right, day three, here we are. Uh, I just woke up, about to head off to the gym. It's probably the last thing I wanna do right now, but that doesn't matter. It's one of those things, you just gotta do it. And I know once I get there, I'm gonna love it. So let's go. By the way, I hope you guys enjoyed that workout sequence because this is the result. So tomorrow morning I'm doing a video shoot for one of my clients where we're gonna be doing some overhead shots, kind of like how-to videos. So right now I'm having a meeting with these awesome guys right here. Uh, to figure out how we're gonna do those overhead shots. Stand, got a mirror, so we shoot from down here to there to get a reflection. So what we need to do is we need to go to my casa, get the freaking stands, and then go source the product, source the mirror, and then find a way how to actually mount it here. So right now, we need to go get two stands, a mirror, and try to figure out how we're gonna rig this thing up. All right, so a quick pause in our plans to go get the mirror and the light stands because the farmer's market's going on and... He's coming! Are these the Japanese yeah. dudes are back? Best, 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 best thing here. So these Japanese grapes are yes. seriously the best thing. Yes. They're the best grapes you will ever have in your life. All right, I will give me a ramito, like a little... This is 15. That's 15? Yeah. Alright, what's for 10? I see $10 right there. $10 I got, I got $10 right here, bro. You can shave the $2. Woo! Beautiful. Steven, last year we yes. found these grapes, right? We did. And what was that like? Like, this is the first time we ever had these grapes. So, when we first found them, the ladies are, oh, try these Japanese grapes. We're like, okay, whatever. We put them in our mouths. Literally, freaking explosion of orgasmic tastes. And then we literally went back to our office and gave them to everyone. Everyone, everyone. Like, dude, you have to try this freaking grape. You have to have it. These grapes are not your average grapes. Look at the size of these grapes. Sauce. Watch out. Look at this. Look at this. These grapes are no joke. Delicious. Austin's about to have one for the first time. Go for it. <laughs> wow. Oh, there's seeds. There are seeds, yes. Wow. How is it? It's even better than a Capri, <laughs> than a Capri Sun. Get in. Oh, watch out. overhead shooting rig is coming together nicely. We are getting all of the materials. Uh -oh. We got a mirror. We've got a couple pieces of 2 by 4 We've got the pole to mount the mirror. Yeah. So because having the guy cut it with a saw was not fun enough, we found somewhere where we can actually How do it ourselves. 80? 80 inches. Sauce. Sauce. That's how it's done. Cut it yourself. No cookie, but it's chill. in a small town, one thing that I do miss is open roads. The traffic in San Diego is real. Thanks 
right These now. guys are going crazy on Pokemon right now. There's Mons, so many Mons. Eggs hatching. Mon. This is a big old Reticate. Here, check this one out. We're back at the office. Oh, you got that one too, dude. And we got the supplies, so hopefully this works. Look at this guy. Magmar. Dude, you got him? Yeah. So there's a little networking party that's being put on here at our office space by the company Zipcar. So let's go check it out. Back to work. Here we are. Working on the mirror project for our overhead rig. Will it work? Are we going to pull this off successfully? Find out tomorrow. <laughs> Alright, so this is what we're trying to do. We're trying to put... Okay, I don't have a caulking gun. I thought I had one. We don't have one, so we're using the stick. We're putting inside the caulking thingy. We're trying to put this on the 2x4. That's right here. These are our main weapons. Hopefully this works. This is DIY. Let's do this. Release. Hold it. Right release. Hold it.